Welcome to Still Las Vegas. In this video, we are going to be talking about some of the different things to do in Las Vegas, and we hope you enjoy watching. Remember to click the thumbs up and subscribe if you like this video. Area 15 is a fantastic attraction in Las Vegas, offering plenty of different things to do. It is an immersive entertainment venue where you will find immersive art experiences, VR attractions, axe throwing, and so much more. Omega Mart is the main attraction at Area 15. It sends you on a surreal kaleidoscopic adventure through secret portals to unexpected landscapes. You start off in the Mega Mart store, where you can spend lots of time enjoying the imaginative products on the shelves, and then you can start your journey through the unexpected portals. For example, through this Mega Mart refrigerator. Once you get there, there's so much to explore. Lots of imaginative art and special lighting effects. It is very cool and so much fun for all ages. There's even a hidden bar within Omega Mart, as well as other bars located in Area 15. Another different thing to do in Las Vegas is to visit Madame Tussauds. This is an attraction that a lot of people don't realise is there, or that a lot of people choose to skip. However, it really is a great place to spend some time. The Las Vegas Madame Tussauds has a lot of Vegas-themed waxworks and photo ops, which can make some fabulous photo memories of your time in Las Vegas. It also has a hangover section, including a hangover-themed bar. This bar has some unique themed shots and cocktails, and is a great place to sit for a break mid-visit to this attraction. There's also a lot of interactive displays and so many waxworks of stars who have performed in Las Vegas, including Elvis, Siegfried and Roy, Celine Dion and Donny and Marie. At the end of this attraction, there's also a Marvel section including a 4D movie experience. Tickets for Madame Tussauds are available on the free-to-play My Vegas app. This is really worth making use of, as you can get your tickets totally free. The Big Apple Coaster at New York, New York is another different thing you can do in Las Vegas. This roller coaster wraps around the New York, New York Hotel building and is a 203 foot drop with breathtaking views over Las Vegas. It is definitely worth a ride and you can also get yourself some free tickets for this one by playing the My Vegas app. If you enjoy roller coasters and rides, then you can also check out the Adventure Dome indoor theme park at Circus Circus. Did you know that the iconic Flamingo Hotel in Las Vegas actually has real flamingos? The Flamingo Wildlife Habitat is located outside near to the hotel's pool area. It is a relaxing spot, a perfect escape from the buzz of the strip. You can explore the peaceful gardens, enjoy the waterfalls and admire the wildlife. You will find turtles, fish and exotic birds, including, of course, the flamingos. This is a great attraction where you can take a short relaxing break and get some lovely photos. Speaking of relaxing, it is another different thing we recommend you do in Las Vegas. When most people think of Las Vegas, they think of gambling and partying. But it is actually a wonderful place to relax, with all the different hotel pools, luxurious hotel rooms and spas. You should definitely take some time out to relax. Hotel pool areas can vary. So if you're looking to relax, make sure you research the pool areas before booking. Many are very chilled and luxurious. We really love the Cosmopolitan Pool and the MGM Grand Pool. You can spend the day sunbathing, enjoying cocktails, foods and cooling down in the pool. Shopping is a well-known Las Vegas attraction. There are many famous malls such as the Forum Shops at Caesars. However, there are some different shops that you may miss and are really worth visiting. These are the shops across from New York, New York. At this location, there's an M&M World with four floors, an equally large Coca-Cola store, an ABC stores, Marshalls and others. Across at New York, New York, there's a large Hershey's Chocolate World as well. The M&M and Coca-Cola stores are especially worth a visit. There are so many floors to explore with some unique Vegas theming. It's a great area to spend an hour or two while you're in Las Vegas. Now let's talk about Topgolf. This is a really fun attraction and something different to do in Vegas. Topgolf is a high-tech driving range where you can play games and enjoy some good food and cocktails. The aim of the game is to hit your golf ball into the giant targets in the field in front of you. It is a huge area and it has some really amazing views of the Las Vegas Strip. You get your own climate control bay with comfortable seating where your host will bring you any food or drink direct to your bay. These are just some of the many different things you can do in Las Vegas. We hope this has shown that there's so much more to do in Las Vegas than gambling and the other well-known attractions. Vegas this really is bursting with attractions and we hope this helps you in deciding what to do with your time when you next visit. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to hit subscribe for our weekly Vegas videos. Also remember to like this video if you enjoyed it as it will help get it out there to more and more people.